Miller and I'm a doTERRA Blue Diamond and today we will be talking about how a silver can own their rank and be the CEO of their business. Owning the rank of silver begins in the heart. It begins with showing up with your passion and with your own inspiration. As a silver leader, it's up to you to create the culture within your community and within your team. Part of that is identifying what matters to you and bringing that influence into everything you do. One of the things that I absolutely teach every one of my silvers is how critical it is to never stop what you were doing before. A lot of times as we reach leadership ranks, it becomes more challenging to manage our time or to stay focused on the original goal, which was sharing oils and empowering others. I would encourage you as you reach the rank of silver and as you're creating that, to stay focused and to keep building, keep sharing those samples, stay focused on finding prospects and stick to your original goal of empowering others. The best way for a silver to impact their team and the people around them is to be super clear on where your time goes and how you're going to manage your different responsibilities. You must continue enrolling people and sharing and teaching classes, but you also want to spend time inspiring your team. And of course you've got to be educating people on the product. One thing that made that super crystal clear in my mind is when I recognized that my team was filled with the runners and the base. And on my particular team, and I think this is true for others, you will have 80% of your team is the base. These are the people that just need love, a little bit of attention, customer service, and knowledge about the product. They want to know how to use the products they already have, and they need encouragement and understanding what products they can use going forward. The runners are the people who are actually running for it. They are running with you and they want the business to grow and to become part of their future. So for me, I spend a little bit of time working with my base and I spend the majority of my time working with the runners. So with the base, I would encourage you to make a quick list of what you will do going forward. And for me, I just identified that it works really great for my team if I run a Facebook group, if I do a couple of webinars each month, teaching different products depending on the theme of the month, and if I offer customer support. Sometimes that can be through emails or texts. Once I wrote those lists out and identified what I was actually committing to do for the base, I was able to focus on my runners and know that I was doing enough for the majority of my team. For my runners, those are the people that I spend time with on the phone, that I mentor one-on-one, -on -one, that I travel to and with to teach classes. I love to do fun things with my runners. Maybe incentives are appropriate, but just make that quick list of what you commit to do for your base and what you commit to do for your runners and stick to that. And I found once I did that, it really was freeing for me because I was able to let go of the guilt and feeling like I needed to be everywhere all the time. A silver can maximize the compensation plan by understanding all the aspects so that you can earn the most money possible. One of the key ways you can do that is by growing your unit level. What I encourage silvers to do is to place your own enrollments on the fourth or fifth level. That will allow you to solidify your rank while maximizing the compensation plan. As a silver, you will now be paid on the lower levels and those are a higher percentage. So placing new enrollments on the fourth and fifth level makes perfect sense. One of the other ways you can place people is to consider your power of three. Do you have a hole in your $1,500 bonus? Can you place someone in a key position that will help both you and your leaders? You can always maintain that enrollment, but you can help others along the way. A silver shows up brilliantly when they own who they are. They recognize themselves as the leader and they show up as the leader everywhere they go. Silvers don't look to others to fix their problems or to make things happen. Silvers know how to make it happen and they trust themselves to create everything they want through doTERRA.